So we're back again, and uh, as Alex was saying, past, present, this future. is future. Future. So with an eye towards the future, uh, the proven strat platform has got the uh, uh, Fishman triple play system in it. So it will wirelessly transmit MIDI data to your computer via a dongle that's kept on the back there. It comes with this massive array of uh, software that goes with it that will enable you to plug straight into sample tank and it will, uh, it will notate uh, what you're playing and you can you know, score what you're playing basically. Uh, it's got this uh, MIDI pickup here, HSS, uh, noiseless pickups and a Seymour Duncan. So it's also got the USB output there. So as well as wirelessly transmitting MIDI data, it will uh, act as a sound card that will be picked up by your computer, works with Apple. So what's, the, what's the mini jack for? Uh, that's so you can you can actually listen to oh, okay. to it as well. Oh, so you can monitor out. Yeah, I see. Yeah, and it works. Yeah. It's just a regular regular strap. That's very cool. Okay. Um, let's grab another one. Can I take this one? Again, with night to the future. I like uh, the colour on this. Yeah. That's Ooh. not normal Lake Placid blue, is it? No, no. It's more sparkly, uh, mystic. Uh, yeah, we've got some mystic sparkles. All of these. Uh, deluxes. Oh, they're all slightly they're sparkly. All, yeah, so we yeah. got a three-tone sunburst that has got a sparkle yep. on it as well. So, uh, with the Deluxe Strap Plus, to all intents and purposes, this is a regular strap, what regular deluxe strap, but it's got uh, this card system in it. It's that crazy. Will essentially rewire uh, your guitar. So it's like S1 switching the next that kind of sort thing. Of, yeah, know. absolutely. So depending on what you've got in there, the tone pots will either change into a, a treble cut and boost, or um, on the HSS something that will blend in some of your neck pick up into the positions that you're in, and uh, blend in uh, tap it single coils. So you can blend in however much you want on the coil there. And you get all these cards with you the get, guitar. Yeah, you get three cards kind of like, with the guitar. Can we see? Oh, can you see in here, this is kind of what the cards look like, and they come in a little wallet, if I remember rightly. Yeah, that's right. Uh, um, there's, a, there's a little wallet that they all come in, and on the uh, Deluxe Strap Plus uh, HSS, all the cards are red, and on the single, uh, all the cards are blue. So, some of these have got uh, little, little micro switches there, so you can switch in and out different capacitors and stuff. And so there's a standard one, a blender, and a cutter. Yeah. Well, so standard is just standard wiring. Uh, blender will blend in, uh, depending on the what position you're in, blend in some of the neck or blend in some of the bridge. So you can get all three on. You can get, you know, a bit of a bit of the front or a bit of the back, uh, blending in with what you've got to set. So in the cutter, turns your tone controls into a. a bass and treble well, cut. As soon as they arrive in the store, Chappers and I will properly demo those because yeah. that sounds a bit weird and freaky, but the last one of the future models yeah. is this flamed beauty. Yeah, so this is to all intents and purposes just a regular uh, plus top uh, coming out of Mexico, so exactly the same as a, as a standard series plus top that we got at the moment, but here you'll see it's got a discrete mini USB and a, a headphone jack, so it's got the, all the iOS connectivity, so... So, so th this is essentially, you did like a Squire version of this just for the Apple Store, didn't you, last year? So this is like the proper version yeah, of it. proper version. Um, so any, anybody that just wants to record straight into their computer, you can do it without an interface with this. Yeah, grown Superb. up Fender guitar, it works seamlessly with all Apple stuff, yep. we'll obviously work with PC as well. Just and if, and if, there's, if there's no battery in it or whatever, it just works as a regular strat, does yeah. it? Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Absolutely. Cool. Well, that's the future. Let's move on to something else. Okay, guess who I found? I found the dude that did the uh, the vaporizer video, and what was the video? Did the Excelsior video from last year, oh, yeah. which are very very cool. What what what's the idea behind vaporizer? 
Uh, it's to explode you. To explode you get you me. so excited that you just go up in flames. It's a great looking, uh, if you haven't seen them, we're just a little pan round here. And the other new amps from Fender this year are... We've got a 57 Deluxe Heads, yeah. and we've got a 65 Deluxe Reverb Head. Awesome stuff. Cool. And a couple of other favourites that you probably haven't seen, or that you, you may have seen, but the, uh, the new 68 reissue series, which are awesome, with the blue writing. That's about it from amps at the moment, so let's move on. Okay, cool. So we've got some signature guitars now. Um, three guitars here, this one, this one, and this one uh, that Alex is gonna tell us all about. So, uh, the Jim Root, uh, already on the Stratocaster and Telecaster platform. He's, uh, he's gone to the Jazzmaster platform now. He's been playing um, this for like about two years or so. Um, so it's got exactly the same features as he's got on his Strat and his Tele. So the EMGs, uh, an 85 and 81. It's got an ebony neck. Uh, it's flat black. It's just got that blade switch and, and one uh, one volume knob. Lock and tuners, satin finish, cut away on the neck. This is the badass one though. Yeah, the Troy Van Leeuwen. So Troy Van Leeuwen, Queens of the Stone Age, uh, failure, um, perfect circle. So he's, I mean, he's basically pimped uh, a regular uh, classic series jazz master and, and, and put on some really sensible upgrades like a Mustang bridge we got here, which is actually brass saddles that have been coated uh, uh, and treated so that they look chrome. It's got some American vintage pickups on it. It's got witch hat knobs on it. It's got a bound neck and a bound block inlay neck. And he's just replaced the regular yeah, with, uh, with, a, with a big old switch there. So there's no there's no centre, is it? Oh, hang on. Yeah, it's just a on-off switch, so that engages the rhythm circuit okay. as normal, but it's yeah. just a much bigger switch. Oh, rather than the little black switch, yeah. Yeah, and it's got this great finished ox blood. We've never done that before. It looks kind of black in certain lights and, you know, nice, really deep, dark red in others. Then the Cobain. So... Now, apparently he actually has personally signed this... I oh, know, because he's dead, that's right. It's just Matt. <laughs> Anyway, so how, how has this come about then? It's basically, it's exactly the same as the road worn version that, that we did a few years ago and we brought it out in, a, in an NOS finish. You know, so, so uh, his, his classic workhorse from the, you know, from the period. And yeah, it's just uh, available in a nice glossy finish, whereas before it was just road worn only. Cool. Thank you very much. Let's move on.